Hi guys, Paul Dexter here. Today we're gonna to make a short video about how to use the iPad app on large scale consultation projects or on small scale projects actually designing, quoting, and selling a project. So we're gonna use a conference room system as an example. So we're uh, here in a conference room. The client just told us they wanna take this terrible tiny TV down and replace it with a, a big 82 inch display. And, uh, and then replace some amplification, put a control system in, and so forth. And we're gonna do it all on the iPad app. So first thing, we'll, we'll uh, come to the iPad, add new project. Conference room, search for our client. Um, we've already done work for this client before, so it's uh, Miller Ton. And we don't need to give it the street address, although we do need the city. Uh, then, maybe we'll take a photo of the room to show uh, what the conference room looks like. Come back here, shoot a photo. I like it. It uploads. And when it's done, we can uh, create our project. Now, we're going to give it the rooms. In this case, there's a conference room. There's an AV, an AV closet. If it had any other rooms, we could, of course, give them custom room names on the fly here. Then we're going to go to systems. It has some audio, it has some video, and it has some control. And again, you can give it custom systems names. These names you set up in your JetBuilt uh, web app, and these are your company's custom settings. They're not JetBuilt's default settings. Go create. If you're an enterprise user, you can decide who sees this project. Uh, we're going to let everybody see it. So now we've got our project. Uh, we're going to click on that and we're going to start adding the items to the project. But before we do that, we're going to take a couple photos uh, just so we can have some photos in our uh, application to take back to the office. So here's the old TV. Let's use that photo. Uh, we could take a few more photos along the way, maybe just to uh, streamline, I'll let that be enough. That's going to be in our, and, and of course our office already sees that uh, right now while we're out in the field. Then we'll go back to our builder where we're going to add items. And so let's start by adding the, the video. Uh, again, you're using items you've set up in JetBuilt. Uh, so you've already got pricing established. You've already got your labor and shipping and everything already established. So let's look for a uh, Samsung uh, package. We know we use this uh, full package quite a bit. We're going to put this in the conference room. We pre-selected video so it lands in the conference room. We know we need to... Uh, uh, for audio, we need to put some speakers in the ceiling they would like. So uh, ceiling, speakers. Here's some Tenoy DI6s that we use. This contains speakers, uh, wiring, uh, even an amplifier. Uh, we're going to throw that in the conference room. Then uh, in the AV closet, we need to give it a processor. Let's use a uh, Symmetrix. And uh, we've used a few uh, symmetrics items. We're not going to use a kit in this case. We're just going to give it the Jupiter 4, throw that in the AV closet. And of course, you can see the price is going up for the system as we do this. Uh, last thing we need is perhaps a uh, um, FSR flex. Oops. Flex unit. Of course, you need to be able to type to use JetBuilt. Here's a Flex LT200. We're going to throw that as a control system. We're going to throw that in the conference room. And so uh, now we've got our, basically that's our system. Uh, of course, we could go in and add more items if we, if we like, but now let's go into our conference room and add a scope of what we're gonna do. So we're going to, uh, uh, of course you would go on more. I'm gonna set this down so I can type faster. Install a new large display uh, speakers amp etc. And you could type the full scope that you want for, uh, for that room. We don't need to go into great detail for this demo. Of course, you can see and verify that down there. And once we've done this and the client likes it, of course, you can again review the price, $11,000. The client says, yeah, I'd like to buy it. And because you've used items that are in your JetBuilt database, you've got your labor, you've got your shipping, you've got your costs, you are, are ready to sell this project to the client. Let's make your proposal. Create proposal use our com commercial proposal light, which is a particular uh, bundle of pages, a group of pages. So here's that proposal, Tapish AV to Miller Ton for a conference room, um, a little bit about our company, and then uh, 
top, and then uh, the conference room system install the large display, speakers, amp, and the audio. We're going to do this video control. Here's the conference room total. A little bit of equipment in that rack, the uh, the Symmetrics Jupiter. And our uh, final uh, page, it all comes together, and we see our project total. Now, of course, you can email this to your client, or maybe the client says, you know what, let's do this and let's start tomorrow. They can click Buy Project. Now the client can come in here and they can sign to buy this project, but it's going to ask you to sign it as vendor. Kim is the vendor. And uh, now we'd like to email them their proposal. So I'll uh, email this to... Let me... Okay. Email this to myself. I could put a note saying, here is your contract. Uh, just a little note they'll get in the email, and we'll send that email. So now you've sold that, e that project. Uh, you've designed it. You've priced it. You've sold it. And it, before you drive home, you've got a, a project in your, uh, in your system that your team, if they were to come into their laptop now and uh, back in the office, your team sees that project. Here it is, conference room system. Of course, they've got the assets, the photos you took on the job site, and uh, they've got the report uh, right here that the client signed. And, uh, and, and furthermore, they could put this project into construction and now start ordering the items for the uh, project. So that is the power of JetBuilt Go, the iPad app for the AV integrator on the go.